Hello and welcome. My name is Lori Nance. I'm the program director at Manuka Retreat and Conference Center. On behalf of our staff and the instructors for our Dulcimer Festival, I welcome you. This evening we are in for a treat from Tull Glazner and Karen Mueller. We hope that you enjoy and we hope that you can show some love in the tip jars. You'll find the tip jars in the description below the video. Show some appreciation for the work that these musicians do to share their music with us, as well as to encourage us to play our own music. So I hope that you enjoy this evening's concert and I hope that we see you at Manuka sometime soon. Well, good evening, everyone. It's glad to be back here at Minucha again, even though uh, we're only here virtually this year. I uh, thought I'd start out this evening with a uh, medley of some old-time waltzes. Uh, first is a tune by an English composer named Pat Shaw, and it's Margaret's Waltz. I learned this from uh, a master fiddler named J.P. Fraley from Eastern Kentucky. And then I'm going to pair that with an old Scottish waltz uh, called Mrs. Jameson's Favorite. And then end up with another tune by Pat Shaw, another of his waltzes called Nan's Waltz.
Well, this next set of tunes I'm going to do for you is a uh, medley of uh, some old Carolyn harp tunes. Uh, Carolyn, of course, was the blind Irish harpist uh, who made his living by going around to uh, different people's homes and uh, they would put him up for the night, give him room and board. Sometimes he would write a tune in their honor. Uh, so these are, those are called Planksties. So uh, this is a couple of Planksties, Planksty Hewlett and Planksty Fanny Power.
can see I've switched to a standard dulcimer here. I'm going to do a set of fiddle tunes for you. Uh, actually, the first tune is a, is a Swedish walking tune. It's what passes for fiddle tunes in Sweden. Uh, this one's called Gardebilin, which I'm not sure I'm, if I'm pronouncing that exactly right, but it translates to uh, the babbling brook. It's a tune I learned from a Swedish nickel harpa player uh, at the Fiddler's Gathering up in Battleground, Indiana, a number of years ago. And then from there, uh, going to an old, uh, uh, old-time fiddle tune called Roscoe. And uh, then after that, we'll go to a couple of ragtime tunes. The first one's called I Don't Love Nobody, and uh, then end up with Hale's Rag.
going to do one last tune for you here. And uh, for this one, I've enlisted some aid. Uh, my cousin, Elizabeth Oliver, uh, is going to join me on this last one. Uh, Elizabeth's father, Marvin, and my mother, Orla, were brother and sister. And so all the years that we were kids growing up, our families would get together at least a couple times a year. And uh, usually during those visits, at some point, uh, Elizabeth's dad and my mom would uh, start singing and playing, and then the rest of the family would join in as best as we could. And I really miss those days. I uh, miss getting to sing with Elizabeth. She lives in California these days, and I'm here in Indiana, so we don't get together very often. Uh, but through the music, uh, magic of the internet, uh, she's going to join me on this. We're going to do a song uh, called Simple Melody. It was written by Irving Berlin uh, back in 1914. And it's a three-part song. And uh, since there's only two of us, that means that Elizabeth is going to have to do double duty on this one. So give me a moment here to reset the stage, and uh, I'll welcome my cousin Elizabeth to join me. Thanks, Elizabeth. That sure was fun to get to uh, make some music with you again. 
And thank you all. Special thanks to uh, Janita and Lori and everyone involved with uh, putting this festival together. I've had another wonderful time here at uh, Manuka and I uh, hope to see you all again down the road somewhere, maybe in person at someday. Uh, in the meantime, stay well, be safe, and keep on strumming. Hi everybody, I'm Karen Mueller and welcome to my concert set for the Manuka Dulcimer Festival Virtual 2021. I'd like to get started with a couple of Swedish tunes. Uh, the first one is called Granin's Basto, which references the neighbor's sauna. And then the second one is called Konvulsionslotten. A couple of tunes in D minor here with that one and a half fret. Here we go. dark minor Swedish tunes for a cloudy, uh, drizzly day here in Minnesota. Makes me feel like I'm in the Pacific Northwest. I'm going to do a finger-picking tune for you now. That was written by my friend and fellow Minnesotan, Peter Ostrushko, who passed away recently. He was a fine, fabulous fiddler and mandolin player probably best known for his work on the Prairie Home Companion radio program as a band member and uh, music director for a long time, as well as a composer of many, many beautiful tunes, such as the one that I'm going to do for you now, called Heart of the Heartland.
such a beautiful tune. Always enjoy playing that. Had some very special times playing that and getting to perform it with Peter himself. So it's time for some fiddle tunes. Time to get your dancing shoes on. The first one is written by Seattle uh, musician Jerry Canote of the Canote Brothers fame. Uh, if you haven't had a chance to see them, either live or online, you need to check out the Canote Brothers, C-A-N-O-T-E. And this tune is called Sadie at the Back Door, written in honor of Jerry's cat, Sadie. So this goes out to all the cat people out there, includes myself. You know who you are. And then the next one is called Johnny Don't Get Drunk. And I can throw that out to anyone who might need that one as well. So here we go, fiddle tunes. my picks on and, and uh, finish up with a couple of auto harp tunes going from three strings to 37 strings also a member of the zither family both of these as is the hammer dulcimer of course <laughs>
really fun tune by Jay Larry. Larry Unger, not Jay. Hi, <laughs> the show can farewell. Larry Unger. Fine tune writer, banjo player, guitar player. So I'd like to close out here with uh, La Partida, one of my favorite tunes, which means the parting. And before I do, I'd like to thank you all for watching and for supporting the Manuka Festival in Manuka, Lori at Manuka, uh, for organizing this along with Janita Baker. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much. Take care. Have a great week. And I hope to see you again sometime soon.